crowds were so intense at all the theaters that they became a police concern. Uniformed guards were hired in all instances to keep thoroughfares clear and prevent violation of the lines. On the more orderly line. We're getting uh, young people, old people, you name it, we get anyone. Well, we drove 100 miles, so I hope so. Fantastic movie. It's really gross. <sighs> it was really terrific. I want to see if it's going to make me throw up. Sometimes even they stand in line for five and seven hours. We've heard some of the people say they've been standing in line that long. And they'll come in and they won't be able to watch the whole movie because it's just too much for them. And they'll come out after about an hour, but they don't complain about standing in line. I want to go home. It makes my heart beat too fast. I don't know, it doesn't bother me that much. But I guess it bothers her more than it bothered me. <laughs> this is the second time we've seen it. We still can't hack it. No. Why? No. I'm not going back in there. I have never in my life known a movie where people would faint. I mean, it's hard to make people faint. Oh, And most of them, once they fainted, they don't go back into the picture. It's probably the grossest thing I've ever seen. Oh, it's weird. She turned her head around. <laughs> she turned her head around. Did you see the part where she turns her head around? Not, not yet. I'm not going to see it either. I ain't never took my coat over <laughs> my face like that. David Sheehan is with us tonight to talk about a movie that has people passing out in the lobby on their way in or on their way out, David. Well, you've heard about all those reports about the exorcist and uh, the trouble that's causing people fainting and so forth. I spent an evening in the lobby just to see if people really do come stumbling out in the middle of the picture as reported. They did, so I asked them why. It just scared me to death. Things just like this, just, it just scared, really scared me to death. I'm just nervous. Do you remember what particular scene it was that... Uh, when that... she was in, what was it? When she was in a room, the doctors came in, and she was, when, I guess it was when she was talking the devil's voice. Oh. oh, God, I can't believe it. Are you gonna go back in and see more of the movie now? Probably, yeah. What are you going to do right now? I don't want to see it, but my curiosity is killing me. I have to see it. I fainted like 10 minutes after the first beginning of the movie. And I walked out, and they gave me some water. I passed out you did? In, in about the first half hour, yeah. yeah. Do you remember what, what it was, what scene it was that affected you so convulsions, much? Convulsions, when she took convulsions. Because I have a little girl, and it was like watching my little girl. My legs are just going, Nyeh. and I want to go in the lobby and not watch it, and I have to cover my ears. <laughs> what was it that made that happen? Just when, when she started talking, like, devil coming out of her. <laughs> How about you? Uh, I can't even describe it. I don't know why I waited four hours to see that. <laughs> why do you believe that The Exorcist is worth such a long wait? Well, I've read the book, and um, I'm just more curious than anything else, I guess. I just... Well, have you heard uh, any discouraging things about the film? Yes, I have debated on whether or not to come, really, but um, my curiosity got the better of me. It's good. It's very good. Do you, do you believe in it? Well, I'm a Catholic. It makes me want to go to church. I thought it was excellent. I really did. I thought it was very good. Yeah, the part where she started spitting all, all the green stuff and, ugh. <laughs> Are you going to go back in as soon as you compose yourself? Yeah, I suppose so. <laughs> You've uh, walked out of the movie three times? Yeah, three. <laughs> on three different occasions? Yeah. You work here, so you've seen the movie several times. You tried to, I right? I tried to, right. <laughs> and you still haven't seen it all the way through? No. Good movie, but it was really scary. I would want to see it a second time. 